So here we go. I can't remember what week this is. It might be week nine. Basically, today I'm doing my first advanced strength session. So we're moving up from from just the normal strength stuff. I feel a lot stronger, and obviously you've got a progressive overload and do some new movements and stuff. So I'll show you. I'll just put it up on the screen of what I'm doing now. So yeah, it's a lot more, you know, trap bar stuff. I'm gonna try my body weight. Probably won't hit it for five reps. You know, that strict press with the barbell. That's gonna be heavy and hard for my shoulder. So. I'm just going to, have to see how that goes. I've warmed up properly and still going to warm up a bit. And then um, I'm just going to film little bits and see how it goes. Nothing too much because I want to focus on actually doing it. But obviously, get the video for like form and stuff to, to look back on and, and see how shit I was today compared to hopefully a couple of weeks' time where it'll be a lot better. <laughs> I think I filmed anything after, after that session. Just made lunch. The first, oh, this angle's horrible. This first advanced strength session went good. It obviously, it felt like my first strength session again, you know, where I'm not good at anything and things are heavy and I'm getting fatigued and that's good. Because now I found something again that I can work on and it's obviously more advanced stuff. So I guess we'll see what I've just done. It all felt good. Obviously the pull-ups are really hard. I feel like I can't engage my back. It's like hard to get that my muscle connection back again where I can properly engage it, where obviously I need to, obviously I've warmed up, but more warm-ups and um, it's just time. So the pull-ups were difficult, even with the, the resistance, because obviously I'm quite heavy. I'm like 96 kg, I think at the moment, 96, 97. I'm still ill, but today's the best day I've felt since, you know, like Saturday, Sunday. And I just had to get out and move because I've been sitting on my bed. I really need to eat this. So I'm just going to eat and talk because um, I literally don't care. <clears throat> Lunges felt okay. I'm just about sorry. <clears throat> Lunges felt okay. My knees held up. My knees hurt. Ooh, tonic water. My knees hurt on the um, trap bar deadlift. I done a rope climb at the end. Completely slipped to the session. Luke told me how to do it, and I just did it. And I then I just, I then I did it in one. Obviously, because I can just jump up halfway, put my feet up, and just stand up, and I'm I'm there. So good day, good training. I'm just gonna wrap it up. You're getting bored. I run out of storage. <laughs> New block of programming. Thanks, Dan. Let's get it. strength session it is what is it monday today first day back after sid after a long weekend of on my feet all day and not actually training um so it felt really good to get back in the gym do some strength work and my the end condition at the end so a 2k row 
and a 10 minute, no, actually 12 minute steady state on the bike at 60 RPM. Last time it felt a bit hard and it was hard to get through, but this time I managed to get through it all like pretty easy, all standard at 60. Went up to 61, 62 sometimes, like held it all the way through. So I was a lot stronger and fitter for that. 2K pro, I got, so I got 718 the other day. I'm, then before we see it, I went down to 715, so I got a three second PB. Today, seven minute 10. And I know I have more, I had more in it as well. Like I, I, I went, really went for it with 100 meters left, but I could have probably done it about 150, maybe 170 and, and got a few extra pulls and it might've got like a couple more seconds. So I'm 10 seconds off of seven minutes and I keep knocking, like that was five seconds off the PB from the other day. The other one was from advanced strength, so that's probably why my legs were a bit worse than today. But I've just got that capacity now to row, and like I kept my technique, and my back was hurting, like my, my ass was hurting, my ass hurts the most on the seat, it's just shit, isn't it? It's a really good session. A bit later in the day than I wanted, but I'll get back and edit now. So I've got that done, eat some food, recover, and um, sub seven minute row, I'm coming for you. It has been a minute. Oh man, it's tough to film in this car. Okay, I don't remember the last time I filmed. You, it's going really good. I'm getting so much stronger, I'm lifting more, doing more weight, uh, sort of reps and stuff. And, and now I've just, I'm doing my advanced strength and more conditioning. My row's getting better. Seven minute, three seconds is my 2K time on the rower. Bit off track, but I'm, it's good conditioning alongside the bikes and doing cows and the ski and stuff like that for my lungs. Today, I'm just gonna get on with today rather than an update video. Today. I've been challenged, me and Hannah have been challenged by, well kind of challenged, by Adam. He'd done, yesterday he'd done a workout and and put his, you know, meters up and, and reps and tagged us. And so me and Hannah were like, let's do it tomorrow. It's both, it's, our, it's both our rest days today is actually, active rest day. So it's our active rest day today doing this wad. I'm excited because again, I haven't really worked out alongside someone i've always went and gone in the corner and been like a little gym rat by myself so it'll be fun to do it alongside with hannah she is feeling sick uh so we'll see if she actually does it and how she feels today we've got turf games tomorrow going over the weekend so it's thursday today so uh, i won't be able to work out properly anyway so i just figured hit this session and then that's helps me not miss a day but yeah let's just fucking let's just let's just go and see what's up at the gym and send it what are we doing today? We're doing some grunt work. <laughs> <laughs> she said she was uh, going to the toilet. So I'm just still standing around talking to Corey. I'm waiting, Hannah. Come on. Come on. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's been like a rhino's tail. Rhino! Is that 50? 40. 40, that's my ball. Fine. Rest day, active recovery. So what we are doing is the grunt work of 20 minute AMRAP, metre row. So every 500 metres on the rower, you get off and do four times 15 metre D-ball carry at 50 kg. I think Hannah's gonna do 50, I'm probably gonna do 40. And then that's unbroken. And then Adam got a score of 3,500 metres with one carry. We're gonna try and beat that. I think Hannah's sorting out the music. Oh no. Just get after it. Let's do it. Are you doing it? Yeah. You're gonna do it, yeah? I'll do it with yeah. Okay, so there's gonna be three of us. So, yeah, well, me and you will go at the same pace. What ball are you gonna use? Go. What weight are you using? I'll use 50. Do you? Yeah. Okay. Woo! So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna jump the box as well. And the rower. Doing a salt course. Right, it's recorded. Ready? Ah. No, just a sec. It's not fair. It's not fair on him, no. You are. You are.
That's done school. That's my school. With one length. That's Hannah's. Oh, mate. Oh, I can't even hold out. Can we find that game? That's a video. Right, big repeat, though. I like a back, just. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I can do. Literally, I'm so wet, I'm just wet. Hands are slippers, I'd grab them before. Yeah, I was grabbing them to my bracelet a bit, so if you eat Adam, I got, I got the same as Adam. Well, obviously, I use a 30kg ball instead of 50. I've got less than Adam, but I use the same ball as him. And it's a rest day. And it's a rest day, active recovery. Oh, well done. Now we're going to do some handstand practice. Me and Hannah are sort of racing to be the better handstand, and my wrist, wrist is quite painful, sharp pain, but I'm going to see what I can do. 